Good morning, Quadcopter 101 here. A few days ago, I did a review, an initial first look at the SEMA X5SC. Uh, in that review, I had noted that there was some issues, possibly some issues, with the flight control software of this quadcopter. I would fly it into a general breeze and it would just stall. Um, what would happen was it would go into the breeze initially and then the quadcopter would uh, pitch would reduce and then become steady and hover in flight. Um, it suggests that there, there might be a problem with the flight control software. I don't know. But what we're going to do today is we hardly have any wind at all. Um, every once in a while we get an occasional little breeze going through here. But we're going to see if, uh, if there's any improvement of the uh, flight uh, control with uh, under low wind conditions with the uh, transmitter. Um, if there is, I also have a SEMA X5C transmitter from the original SEMA X5C, um, actually X5C-1 that we can try. And also, this uh, SEMA X5SC transmitter also works with the SEMA X5C-1. And I'll try that to see if there's any, and we'll compare the uh, flight performance between both the SEMA X5C-1 versus the X5SC uh, to see, to compare the flight performance between the two using the transmitter that comes with the SEMA X5SC. So let's go into a flight and see how it's doing. Right now I got a nice little breeze starting to pick up coming from that direction. We'll fly into it and see what, what happens. Turning on the camera or turning on the quadcopter and turning on the transmitter, binding it to the quadcopter. And I'm going straight to high. We're not going to mess with uh, low setting today. And there we go. It seems to be going fine initially into the wind. And then again, there you go. It stalls. <laughs> Goes fine going downwind. Let's bring it downwind. Let's bring it down low again. Going into the wind. And then it stalls. Okay, going downwind, the pitch just keeps increasing while it's going downwind, then you go into the wind, does fine initially, and then it stalls. Let's bring it up. Okay, I'm at full forward pitch. Now full forward pitch going downwind. Notice the pitch keeps increasing. <laughs> so again, it suggests that there might be a a minus side or a positive side where vice versa should be. Full forward pitch, folks, and we're talking about a two mile per hour wind. Let's turn on the camera. Okay, full forward pitch going upwind. It does have nice range on it, though. I admit that. Okay, better come down way too high. Full forward pitch, reducing throttle. You know there's a. Okay, going downwind, full forward pitch, that'll help. Okay, I want to take a look at this camera, see if it's recording. Bringing it in behind. And I'm going to land it right here. Looking at the camera light, I don't see. Okay, it's red. Pressing down, and it went back to green. So it recorded. So once again, the wind's coming from that direction now. Going full forward pitch. Just has a problem in the wind. It just doesn't like wind. Going downwind. Full forward pitch, folks. It's just not going to make it across the lake. <laughs> There's the wind we're talking about here. We're not talking significant wind. Bring it down close. Let's 
Okay, let's try some maneuverability with this thing. This is the funnels it can do and high. Left funnels. I haven't demonstrated flip yet. There we go. I guess you gotta hold the flip button down to do a flip. Let's bring it down close to show you the flipping. But there's full forward pitch and full forward pitch going downwind. Full forward pitch. Okay, now it's speeding up and then it and then it just slows down. It's just a weird thing it does. When it goes into the wind, it does fine initially, and then it just slows itself down. Look, see, nice nice forward pitch, and then it, and it just hovers in the wind. Okay, my lights are blinking. Now let's try similar flying using the SEMA X5C-1. Let me land this. And we'll do use the same transmitter with the SEMA X5C-1. Okay, we did an initial flight with the X5SC. Now it's the turn of the SEMA X5C-1. I'm turning on the quadcopter. And again, I'm using the same transmitter as the SEMA X5SC. They both bind together. Both can be used except for a headless mode. You can't use headless mode with that. And if you use that one's transmitter with that, uh, it will not activate headless mode. So headless mode is the, the, the uh, thing that you can't use between the two. Go into high. This thing has no problem at all going into the wind. <laughs> with a camera attached. No problem at all with this one going into the wind. So I don't know what the issue is with the X5SC. It just doesn't like to go into the wind. Okay, the wind's dying down, but okay, we've got a wind coming from that direction now. Easily fights the wind. So again, don't know what the issue is with the X5SC and wind. Hey, since this thing has great range, let's see if I can go down by the... Uh, oh, boy, this has good range. This has good range on this transmitter. <laughs> but uh, has issues with flying on the X5SC. Okay, so it's not the transmitter. The issue appears to be with the quadcopter itself. <laughs> this does better flips, by the way, than the uh, X5SC. So again, um, I don't know what to tell you folks. Uh, X5SC, at least the one that I got, does not like wind. So quadcopter 101 bringing this in. Lots of butterflies out here today going after uh, wildflowers. There's a nice wind coming from that direction. Go into it. No problem. <laughs> Again, better range on this transmitter, by the way, at least compared to my X5SC transmitter. Okay, I'm bringing it in. I think that demonstrates the point. So, I understand 
that SEMA has released an upgraded X5SC-1 similar to the way they released this SEMA X5C-1. Um, I don't know if that corrects the issue. Uh, I'll try to see about getting a, a copy of the X5C, X5SC-1 to see if uh, the issues with the wind are corrected. But again, uh, I noted again that um, the X5SC has a problem just going into the wind. It just seems to go into a hover. Okay, Quadcopter 101. Hope you enjoyed this flight. Quadcopter 101, signing out.